you've got to go fishing. Okay, first thing I'm noticing is the current on top is going faster than the current underneath. I was hoping to fish a small, a small shrimp type fly, but I don't think that's going to work with the way the, the current is ripping through here. switch to a little clouser type fly and see if that does the trick. A little spotty. There we go. So I thought a Corbina, a nice one too. Oh, that is a toad Corbina. Right now I wish I had a net, but I don't. I'm just gonna have to do the best I can. All right, come here. Oh, maybe he's not quite done yet. Thought he was. Whoa. 
Now that is a nice bean. Yes, look at that. And away she goes. Nice. <laughs> cool. Okay, I want to do that again. <laughs> oh. Next time, bring a net. Well, not a bad day. Came out here with a fly rod in hopes of, uh, actually in hopes of catching a corbina, which I did. It was fun. Um, I've got uh, my Fenwick. It's marked an eight weight, but it's actually a seven weight. It was a uh, mismark at the factory and um, I got a good deal on it when Fenwick used to uh, be in the city of Westminster, which is not too far from here. So this was the rod for the day. This is not the fly I caught the Corbina on, but it's pretty darn close. It's, um, you know, I lost the fly that, that I actually got the Corbina on. But, um, well, I tried for another hour and a half, maybe two hours, and not another bite. So I got the little, little spotted bay bass, the one Corbina, and that is all. This is actually the third time I'm trying to fish here with a fly rod. The first time I came here, there, uh, there were Santa Ana winds blowing and you know, it was just gonna be impossible with a fly rod. The second time I came here with the fly rod, what happened that time? There were a bunch of, um, a bunch of uh, what do you call that? Caltrans people walking up and down this bank, cleaning it up. There's still a lot of garbage, but they did clean up quite a bit of stuff that was laying around. And then as I got here today, right there, there was a, a homeless encampment and it was on fire. And I thought, oh crap, okay, the fire department's gonna come and uh, there's gonna be police and I don't know how they feel about me fishing here. But uh, I waited about 20 minutes and they didn't show up. So I came fishing and it was a pretty nice afternoon. Anyway, take a look around. Cool place. Very slippery rocks. Have a great day.